welcome to best car fixes uh, this is Muhammad Harun Idris please subscribe share and like 2023 Ford um, Expedition and uh, this car here the front radar was being replaced and you see here we have pre collusion assist uh, code the funny thing is that the customer told me that he changed the headlight this is this headlight it have computer here it have a computer there and if you change the headlight you have to and calibrate the sensors I did that one and after that I have to do I have this code on the cruise control or forwarded camera I have two code forward forward looking camera sensor initialization and also initialization configuration not complete and I asked him hey um, I was driving the car is supposed to go into um, the programming test in a few seconds but it never go so I stop, I say, look, I'm driving this car for almost 10 minutes. And uh, what happened? I'm not able to initialize it. He said, oh, sorry, I forgot to tell you that I already, I changed the module. So if you change the module, this application enables the user to install replace module. And this one here enables the user to install a replacement module. So now he already... So I'm gonna CCM installation PMI module. This is configuration. So I believe I need this one. I gotta do this one here. Because it's say not configured. So I'm going to configure the CM. I'm gonna configure the CCM module. Yeah, the battery must be full and all this so let me turn the key ignition off now i am going ignition uh, engine engine ignition on engine off okay so now i'm gonna do cruise control module cc ccm cruise configuration and i have a code for configuration so i'm gonna wait for it to be configured cruise control module configuration the module will now be configured. Be sure you have internet. We're using a Ford VCM2, maybe VCM3 sometime. It looks like this car is vandalized. Somebody with a cigarette or something, he messed up this. Wow. I don't know, now you see I'm, I'm updating the system. This car is good. This hazard, the slippery off. It doesn't want to enter into the counting, you know, like it's supposed to start counting um, when you drive and it give you the situation where you are or what happened. Okay, turn this one off. Application finish. Now I have one thing to do. I will go back to to my uh, system and see if um, this the test is okay. Run. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna choose this one. Only this one. I supposed to have <coughs> one code disappear, <coughs> and then we're gonna do the alignment for the camera. One code supposed to go away for the configuration initialization. You see now we have forward looking camera forward initialization this one we have to do this one the bottom one is done so i gotta go back to toolbox 
and then from here I will go to initialization now I'm gonna run this it's supposed to start counting as soon as I start it you're gonna give you some information you have to say yes and start alignment and then from here we can drive say yes ignition on you see here still pre-collusion assist you have to read all the information here the vehicle must be driven on a public road to allow the calibration value to be learned the time take for the, the test complete will depend upon the driving condition as the calibration data is learned the program will, will instrument drive the vehicle until the test is complete this will take approximately 15 minutes this test may be aborted at any time by pressing the cancel button or turning off the vehicle ignition the vehicle fitted with the start stop system this feature must be disabled during Okay, right now 125 I'm gonna start the car and now we're gonna continue this time it will take it so let's go counting down the car have to be driven you see here start already the car have to be driven and the calculation is already 93 out of 125 You see that piece there? Now we have 48 out of 125. We keep going. Front sensor not aligned. We keep going. I am going to take a highway. This is King Plaza, beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna take the highway, even though now I have like uh, 64, something or 84, almost there. So I'm gonna take a small highway quick and then I come back. And at that time, if it's like everything is okay, we're good to go. Stay with us one out of 124 so I have to drive a little bit drive this car here and now you see everything is changed there's no sign there's no nothing beautiful I gotta stop it check out that To drive all the way to the beach here you see this is uh far rockaway that's beautiful far very far there and here you see adaptive cruise is finished now i gotta exit say yes okay continue turn the key off application finish in the key we did the headlight we did the cruise control this may take a few minutes we're gonna wait till everything is okay we come out you can show you the history also if you want the history here Show the history. There is no history. They say it's okay. Uh, now I'm gonna clear the codes. Self test for CCN.
ok, run the test and then it's supposed to be gray green or you can clear them, clear them out after that it's gonna be only one coat Okay, let me, um, it says not yet, but let me try to clear the codes. Clear and test. Continue. I don't want this code anymore. B1443, forward looking alignment. Now we're going to go into green, green. Yes. So it's done. Those are the codes in the bottom. And this is normal active cruise, full access remote. Please subscribe, share and like. I'll see you in another video. This is Muhammad Harun Idris. Now I'm gonna go back.